Hello friends and viewers, welcome to all of you. In today's problem, we are given a square ABCD of unknown side and P is any point inside this square such that length of PA is 1 unit and length of PB 2 units and PC is 3 units. We have to find this area. We will discuss two methods how to solve this problem. One is by geometry method and other is by trigonometry method. In this geometry method, let each side of the square be A units and draw perpendicular to AB from point P and draw perpendicular to BC from point P. Let QB will be X and since AB length we have already assumed that A, so AQ will be A minus X. Let this PQ be Y and then RB is Y and this remaining CR will be A minus Y. So we have three right angle triangles, this PQA, this PRC and then this PRB. This is X, so this will also be X. In triangle PRC by Pythagoras theorem, PC square is equal to PR square plus RC square. It means 3 square is equal to x square plus a minus y the whole square. In this triangle PQA, PA square is equal to PQ square plus QA square. Now in triangles PRB, this x square plus y square is 2 square. Using x square plus y square as 4 from third in first and second, so we are getting a square minus 2ay plus 4 is equal to 9 and that gives is equal to 5. After simplification, 2ay is equal to a square minus 5. So y is equal to a square minus 5 by 2a. a square minus 5 by 2a. Similarly, from equation 2, if we substitute x square plus y square is equal to 4, then we will get a square minus 2ax plus 4 is equal to 1 and which gives a square minus 2ax is equal to minus 3 and that is equal to x is equal to a square plus 3 by 2a. This is fifth result. Now from this fourth result and fifth result, we substitute x value y value in this x square plus y square is equal to 4. So if we substitute that, we will get a square plus 3 by 2a the whole square plus a square minus 5 by 2 the whole square that is equal to 4 which gives 2a square means 4 a square take common a square plus 3 the whole square is a4 plus 6a square plus 9 so which after simplification this 4 is square multiplied to 16 so 16 I'm oh sorry 4 this is 4 this 4 is square is multiplied in this 4 we will get 16 a square so a4 a4 2 a4 that gives divide throughout by 2 a4 minus 10 a square plus 34 is equal to 0 now using quadratic formula for this quadratic equation if we use quadratic formula so we will get this quadratic of a square a square the whole square minus 10 a square plus this so we will get a square is equal to a square is equal to 
माइनस बी सो माइनस माइनस प्लस तो टेन प्लस माइनस अंडर रूट बी स्क्वायर दैट इज टेन स्क्वायर हंड्रेड माइनस फोर इंटू ए इज वन सी इज थर्टी फोर सॉरी दिस आफ्टर डिविजन विथ टू दिस विल बी सेवेंटीन सो माइनस फोर ए सी माइनस सिक्सटी एट एंड दिस टोटल अपॉन टू ए सो सिंस द साइड ऑफ द स्क्वायर इज ए सो ए स्क्वायर विल डायरेक्टली गिव अस द स्क्वायर सो वी आर गेटिंग हियर टेन प्लस माइनस अंडर रूट थर्टी टू बाई टू दिस रूट थर्टी टू इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटीन इंटू टू फोर रूट टू इट विल बी टेन प्लस माइनस फोर रूट टू बाई टू एंड टू इज डिवाइडेड इन बोथ सो फाइव प्लस टू रूट टू एंड माइनस ऑल्सो but 5 minus 2 root 2 will be uh, very less to so ignoring that therefore we got a square is equal to 5 plus 2 root 2 square units and that is the area of the square in this method if we rotate this square around this point b counter clockwise to 90 degree this c will be over here after rotation c dash here and this d will be d dash over here and this pb after 90 degree will be over here somewhere so this square is rotated through 90 degree counter clockwise about point b so a will be over here D is D dash here and C is C dash here, P is P dash here. So P B is equal to B P dash. This is two. This is ninety degree. If we join P P dash, P B is equal to B P dash, and this is ninety. So this will be forty five forty five by Pythagoras theorem. Sum of the squares of these two will be two square plus two square four plus four is eight. So this will be root eight. Now P A is one, so P dash A dash will be also one. Consider triangle P C P dash or P A dash P dash. P C square is nine and C P dash square is one and this P P dash square is eight. So eight plus one is nine. We are getting P A dash square C P dash square plus P P dash square because this is nine and this is one plus P P dash square is eight. So by converse of Pythagoras theorem. this will be a right angled triangle and right angled at this the diagram is not drawn to scale so angle a dash p dash p is equal to 90 degree and therefore this will be 90 plus 45 so we found angle a dash p dash b equal to 90 plus 45 is 135 now in triangle a dash p dash b dash we can apply cosine rule so if triangle is like this this is 135 this is 1 and this is 2 so this we can find if we find bc then square of bc will give you the area of the square using cosine rule cos 135 is equal to let us suppose this point is M N R. So, cos one thirty five is equal to one square M N square plus M R square minus N R square by two M N M R. So one square plus two square minus N R square 
by two into these two, two into one into two. Cos one thirty five is equal to minus one upon root two, and this two into two is four. So here it is one plus four is five. N R square. Now four by four by root two is this is minus two root two, and which is five minus N R square. So therefore, N R square is equal to take it left and send it in right. Five plus two root two. But this N R is nothing but this side B C, which is B C square equal to B C square is five plus two root two. And this side square is equal to area of the square, and that is the answer once again.